welcome to Lavanya's computer classes. In this video, I will explain Unit 3 Programming for Problem Solving PPS Short Answer Questions that is also R20 to JNTH pattern. These all questions are <coughs> for all <coughs> CSE, ECE, Civil, Mechanical for all the students same questions PPS. Okay. So, that is also unit 3. In the unit 3, there are two chapters are there. One is the preprocessors and second one is the file handlings in C language. So, the short answer questions are first one is first chapter from first chapter that is preprocessors. First question is define preprocessor. What is preprocessor? Just definition of preprocessor. And second question is list out the preprocessor command directives. That means so, uh, give some examples for preprocessor directives or uh, which symbols are used for preprocessor directives. Third question is explain about defined preprocessor. Second question only otherwise they are asking individually. Or sometimes they are asking explain about hash define. Hash is the symbol for preprocessor directive. Hash defined preprocessor or they are asking directly explain about the defined define preprocessor. Any preprocessor they are asking. Or next one is difference between if def and if and def preprocessor directives or difference between hash if def and hash if and def. These are the equations and preprocessor. Next one is define file what is file next explain different types of files different types of files means again text files and binary files at same question they are asking like this also difference between text files and binary files then very very important question is different modes available in the files that is either modes in text files or modes in binary files read mode append mode write mode r plus rb plus like this next one is how to read and write data into the file that means what is the open command uh, close command read command write command with syntaxes next how to append the data in the existing file append mode and then syntax for append and some simple example program explain the operations of random access files same question down also same question explain fseek function ftl function and rewind function so, those are also examples for the random access files. So, these are the very very important questions in uh, unit 3. Same questions are coming for uh, SI type questions also. There is no difference between um, short answers and uh, long answers. Same question explain about preprocessor. If the same question is coming for SI type question, then write think about the marks and elaborate the answer. Okay. Thank you for watching my video. Read all this question, share it to your friends. I will provide the notes for all these important questions also. Thank you.